हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू द नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ क्लास नाइन्थ सेशन सिक्स यूनिट वन इन दिस वीडियो आई विल डिस्कस द रिमेनिंग टॉपिक्स ऑफ यूनिट वन सेशन सिक्स आई होप यू हैव वॉच द प्रीवियस वीडियोज एंड अंडरस्टूड द टॉपिक्स मैंशन इन दैट इफ यू हैव नॉट वॉच टिल नाउ प्लीज वॉच इट एंड डू द असाइनमेंट क्वेश्चन मैंशन इन दैट वन नाउ लेट स्टार्ट with the first topic of this video that is moving or copying a file or folder between storage devices means how to copy or move any file or folder from your computer to any pen drive or the memory card or another any other removable devices for doing so we have to follow some steps let's discuss these steps first of all attach a pen drive to our computer after that right click on the start button and windows open windows explorer or you can directly open my computer where all the devices all the drives will be displayed now open d drive for example open d drive from the navigation pane at the left or from the local disk d icon once you open d drive all the folders and files of d drive will be displayed now select the file or folder which you want to uh, transfer from your computer to the pen drive once you select the that particular file or folder just right click on it and choose cut option or copy option from the shortcut menu as i already told you cut option is for moving the file or folder and the copy option is for copying the file and folder from one place to another once you cut or copy uh, any file then click on the pen drive icon from the navigation pan or just open the pen drive icon from the my computer window once that pen drive will be opened up it will display all the contents of particular pen drive after opening the uh, pen drive window just right click on the blank option blank area from that window once you right click on the blank area you will see a paste option from the shortcut menu select that paste option and you will notice that the selected file from d drive will be copied will be pasted in your pen drive once the copying or moving is over you can easily remove the pen drive from your computer now the next topic is deleting a file or folder for deleting any file or folder we have to follow some steps the first step is open the windows explorer and go to that file which you want to delete or the folder which you want to delete once you reach to the file th that particular file or folder select it and click on the organize option which is at the top mo top left or side of the window when you click on organize option you will see a shortcut menu will appear and there the delete option is available click on the delete option once you click on delete option you will see a message box appears for the confirmation of deleting the file or folder that message bo box contains two buttons one is yes and the another one is no yes is for deleting the object and no is for not deleting the object once you click on yes option then the desired file which you want to delete will be deleted and transferred to the recycle bin the other method of deleting the file or folder is that we simply have to select that particular file or folder and press delete button from the keyboard once you delete the uh, once you press the delete button it will again op, uh, ask as a confirmation message of yes and no and the deleted file will be transferred to the recycle bin we can also re restore the deleted file from the recycle bin if we want 
For retrieving that file, we have to open recycle bin option which is given on the desktop. Just go to that option and double click on it. It will display all the, those icons of files which is deleted and transferred to recycle bin. Select that particular file which you want to restore and right click on it. When you right click on it, you will see there is an option of restore. Just click on it and that particular file will be automatically transferred to that particular location from where it is deleted. Means any file, if any file was deleted from D drive and we will re restore it from the recycle bin, then that particular file will automatically restored in the D drive folder only. If you want to permanently delete all the files and folders from the recycle bin, just right click on the recycle bin option and you will see empty recycle bin option from it. Just click on that option and you will see a message of yes or no. It will ask that uh, do you want to delete all the files permanently. If you will select yes, the recycle bin is empty and all the fi files and folders uh, in the recycle bin will get permanently deleted. And if you don't want to delete it, just select the no option. Next topic is searching a file or folder. There are various ways in Windows 7 and the early, uh, upper version of operating system to search any file or folder. The very common method of searching a file folder in Windows is search box. For searching any file or, uh, or folder, we must know at least the starting name of that particular file or folder or the type of file or you want to search. For searching on the search box, simply click on start button and you will see a search box option just above the start button. Click on that search box and type a part of at least a part of the file or folder name or if you know then type the complete name of that particular file or folder or you can also type the phrase which is written on that particular file. Once you type it will start giving the those items that is matching with your text which you are writing in the search box. If you will get that particular file in the search menu or in the search result, just click on it and open that file or folder. Otherwise, click on see more results from the link which is given in the search box uh, search result only. And once you see that particular file or folder, just double click on it and you will see that the that particular file or folder will get opened that's all for this video in the next video i will discuss the remaining topics of this particular chapter